Good morning everyone. What's up and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a little bit different than anything I've really done before. Um, I'm going to be doing a weekend in my life vlog. It's around 7.30 right now. I was going to go to bar at 6.30 but I woke up and I was just so tired. I just haven't slept much this week so I was like I'm not going to go today. So yeah, I was going to go to bar but right now it's around 7.30 so I'm going to get some food and coffee in me and then I'm going to start cleaning and then I'll also start doing laundry and then once the stores are actually open, I'm going to go somewhere and get some Christmas tree ornaments and a skirt for the tree because I did order a Christmas tree on Amazon and it was it's like six feet tall, but it was only like $35 or something. So that comes in the mail today, so we'll be setting that up later in the vlog. And then at 11-ish, I'm going to be meeting up with my marketing group to work on our presentation that we have to do at the end of this month and we haven't started yet, so we need to get on that. And then once Katie gets out of class around 1-ish, we're going to go to brunch or breakfast, lunch, whatever. I think her friend Selene and my friend Julia is also coming with us. And then after we eat, we're going to get our nails done. And then after we get our nails done, she's, Katie is going to help me get some shots for a video that I need to get filmed. And then after all of that, I'm hoping to come back home, set up the Christmas tree, hopefully get a little bit of studying done. I probably won't have that much time. And then my mom comes in town tonight and we'll go to dinner with her whenever she gets in probably. So yeah, that's everything for today. I just kind of wanted to give you a rundown of the day before um, I just start doing everything because it's going to be a very busy day. <laughs> Shuffle New Music Friday playlist on Spotify. Shuffle New Music Friday from Spotify. Hey y'all, so it's around 9.30 now and I got the whole apartment clean and got my room clean so it felt really good. Also, I just want to remind you all that I literally have a 70% off coupon code for a Vanity Planet spin brush. Um, they literally only asked me to collaborate with them on one video, but I'm telling you all that you need to get one because it has made a huge difference in my skin. I was like breaking out so bad when I first got it and I'm using the same like cleanser and everything. And like even the blemishes from it are going away, which is insane. And I've noticed a difference in the way my skin feels after I wash my face. Because when I wash my face with my hands, I feel like there's still either residue or my face doesn't completely feel clean. clean. But with this, I literally feel like I just rip a layer of my skin off of my face and it just feels so good afterwards. So definitely go get one because you can get it for $30 and it makes a huge difference in the way your skin feels and it just feels good to get a good clean in your skin. Now I'll have that code and link down below so you all can get one. So my makeup is done. Obviously I put on a little bit more than I initially anticipated, but whatever. I used my naked palette for the first time in a good long time today and I realized that I've had it since my sophomore year of high school so and I'm a sophomore in college now so that's really embarrassing. So I ended up not meeting up with my marketing group. Um, they couldn't make it which is okay. I have plenty to do. I'm about to go run to the store get some ornaments and a tree skirt and run a few other errands before I meet up with my friends later and I'm just wearing this shirt from Romway. These joggers are from Aerie. They're so comfortable. I wear them all the time around the house. And then my white Adidas, I look like a boy, but it's fine. I just spilled my coffee all over me and now I smell like Starbucks. So I was gonna get a bunch of Christmas decorations in there, but I didn't because they were expensive. So instead, I just got ornament hooks because they were a dollar. Got this adorable tree that now has coffee all over it. It was like $3 in the dollar section. I got some of this garland. I actually have this in my room at home and this was $3 in the dollar section. And then I got shaving cream. My bag is literally covered in coffee. So I just got home from looking for Christmas stuff and I just changed real quick. It's literally so hot outside so I didn't know what to throw on. I was not planning on wearing this so I had to throw something on real quick because I'm running late. Um, I'm not sure where this top is from. I want to say like Forever 21 or Old Navy or something like that. Forever 21 jeans, Birkenstocks. Not the best outfit but it'll do. back to my place we just got our nails done and went to brunch at another broken egg it was great 
Um, I got the dip powder nail thing done. I The guy was like, oh, it's $5 more. It lasts longer. It's shinier. And I'm terrible at saying no to people. So I was just like, oh yeah, sure, whatever. And so I got the dip powder. But that was definitely a weird thing, but they feel really smooth, so that's nice. And I do feel like they'll last really long because it's like really thick. <laughs> Just finished decorating the tree. Hey Macy. <laughs> it looks so good. I love the ornaments. We're actually gonna go ahead and go pick up the skirt and the star now because we just want to get it done with and it's only 615. We have all this going on. It's literally like a winter wonderland in here, but it's fine. <laughs> and if y'all are wondering where to get a tall tree for cheap, go on Amazon and just filter it to like six foot and green tree, and this comes up and it's like $38. Ornaments are from Michaels, they were 15% off. It's a 50 count for $15, so that's a good deal. And then I got the lights at Michaels as well, and they were $4 each, and I just got three packs. I'm gonna start crying. Oh, please. <laughs> literally starts crying. It's literally so lit. <laughs> We went and got a skirt. This one is from TJ Maxx. It was $20 and Ella's laying on it. She's cute. Oh, okay, you always get up when I bring the camera in your face. We got this tree from, or not this tree, this star from Kirkland's and it's so pretty but it's way too heavy for the tree and the tree like completely falls forward every time we try and put it on. We tried to use rubber bands to hold it down but it's not working so we might have to return it but it was only like $12. So we fixed it, but it looks really dumb because we had to stick like four branches through it and now there's like not a top to the tree, but it's fine. It's better than not having a star. <laughs> it's beautiful. <laughs> All right, also it's about eight o'clock now and my mom's pretty much here in town in Tuscaloosa. So we're about to go to dinner now and I just wanted to show y'all my little outfits of the night. This sweater is from Zaffle and my jeans are Forever 21. The boots are my roommates. Um, I don't know where they're from. I will ask her if I remember and put them in the description. And then I have my Happiness Boutique little necklace on that I love so much. And I just put my hair half up and I'm about to put on this MAC Velvet Teddy lipstick. And we are going to a Mexican restaurant downtown. It's called Central Mesa. If you ever go to Tuscaloosa or if you are in Tuscaloosa, definitely go there. They have homemade tortillas and amazing queso and street corn. It's so, so good. Hey guys, so it is the next day. It's around 9.30, I believe, and I'm getting ready to head to the game. We are playing Mercer at 11, so it's definitely an early game, and I think I may go and get some breakfast real quick or something with my family, and I'm going to show y'all what I'm wearing. This is my outfit. It's just my Happiness Boutique um, necklace, some gold hoops from Dillard's, this shirt from Romway that I love. The skirt is also from Romway, and then my black Steve Madden little shoes. We're getting ready to go now. <laughs> The kick is good. As y'all just saw, um, it was pouring down rain in the last clip of the vlog. It's around 7.30 right now. Um, basically, we went to the game. We stayed the whole game. I think it got over around 2-ish. And then we went to De Palma's, which is a really good Italian restaurant. And we had to wait like 30 minutes, so we were there for a while. We went there, and then we um, decided to go to the Riverwalk and walk along it. And basically, a ton of businesses. And then like each like 
school at Alabama, like the business school, nursing school and everything, have decorated Christmas trees out and it's like really, really pretty because it's a ton of them in a row as you all saw on the vlog. But it started pour, like downpouring. I have never like had to walk through rain that heavy before. And I had, like, we had our dogs with us. So they got soaked. I just bathed a lot on Wednesday. So we had to run underneath like a building to get coverage because it was raining so bad. Like a tree snapped, like it was bad. It looked like it was about to, I don't know, it looked like stuff was about to go down. We had to wait under there till for it to calm down and then we made it back to the car. So it was fine eventually, but we got soaked and it's around 7.30 now, I'm gonna shower. I just bathed Ella again. And then I'm going to just look at study abroad programs and clean up my room some because it's a disaster. But yeah, that's all going on for tonight. Hey guys, so it is Sunday, it is the next day, and I'm fixing to go to Babe's Donuts with my family before my mom heads out. It's around 9 o'clock, and I'm just wearing this because I'm going to church at 11.30, so I wanted to go ahead and get ready. Have on my Happiness Boutique necklace. Sweater is from Cupshe, jacket is Forever 21, jeans are Banana Republic, I think. My booties are Target, and I'm about to head out the door now. Hey guys, so it's around 10 right now. As you all just saw, I went to Babe's, and I got an upside down latte. I think it was basically a caramel macchiato, but backwards. It was really good, and I had a honey, but honey butter chicken biscuit. That was also so good. Right now it's around 10, and I'm going to head to Target because I ordered a little banner thing online last night to pick up in store because there were only two left, it said that says gather and I got that for Friendsgiving tonight. I'm gonna go pick that up and then get the ingredients for what I need to make for Friendsgiving and then I'm going to church at 11.30 and I'm gonna meet Katie and her boyfriend and her friend Brandon there and then Griffin and his friend Rob are coming with me. So we're all gonna meet there around 11.30 but right now I'm just gonna go get the ingredients for the stuff for Friendsgiving and get that banner. <laughs> But I just wanted to talk about something real quick because I know this vlog is probably not that long um, Just because I've been showing y'all what I'm doing instead of talking about it since it's more of a weekend vlog And I just kind of show y'all what I do instead of talk about it. I don't know if this ever happens to y'all But it really used to not happen to me that often But I feel like now that I really pay attention to what's going on around me and really just try and live more in the moment instead of always thinking about the next thing to come or thinking about the past. I just have these moments where I get so overwhelmed with just how blessed I am and like just how just amazing life is and I don't really know how to explain it. Basically, I was just sitting there thinking like I, this time last year, I would have never, ever, ever expected to be where I am today. Um, I'm honestly like so proud of myself, I guess, because like this past summer, and all of my freshman year of college, it was the most challenging thing I've ever been through. Um, a lot of personal things went on that like y'all don't really know about, but I probably will never like tell y'all about because it's just kind of like family stuff. But a lot of just like personal things happened and then it was just a really hard time in general. My first year of college, um, if y'all have been watching my videos since the beginning, y'all know that my freshman year was not the average freshman year. And it was just a really hard time for me and I was just at such a low point in my life like this time last year to where I didn't really think I was ever gonna be happy here at Alabama. Like I tried to transfer to run away from like the sadness that I was feeling here and like the loneliness I was feeling, which is not the answer like whatsoever. And basically like I was just sitting there thinking yesterday, like I've made so many like amazing, I mean not so many, but I've made like a good bit of just amazing friends this year. And I just can't imagine if I would have transferred like it honestly probably would have been the worst thing I could have done and I'm just so blessed like I'm so happy that I have the opportunity to like go to college because going to college has done so much for me academically mentally emotionally and even like with my family I used to be someone who wasn't close with their parents whatsoever like I never talked to them like I just didn't I just wasn't close with them I just wasn't and so coming to college has made me like so so close with my family and just become like best friends with my mom you know like and I was longing for that and the fact that I'm getting my education and not having to pay for the tuition and just all this stuff like I'm literally just so blessed and sometimes you just have to like take a step back and really appreciate everything you have in life because I feel like we get so caught up in the moment sometimes that we just like don't take time to really acknowledge how blessed we are even when you don't have a lot and even when times suck like you're still doing okay most of the time I never thought that I would have a YouTube channel that I've like always dreamed of and like be doing well with it and truly enjoy it and like I just never thought it would bring me so much happiness and 
I didn't think I would ever meet so many amazing people like within the short time that I've been here during the fall and like I didn't think that I would have the opportunities that have come my way like academically and extracurricularly if that's a word I just never thought any of this would ever happen and I'm just like so thankful and it's just you know it's it's around the Thanksgiving season and I just wanted to say that like definitely take time every day to think about the things in life that you're blessed with and you will truly be so much happier if you sit there and dwell on the things that you are blessed with than to sit on and think about what you don't have that's truly a just poisonous and terrible thing to do is just sit there and think about the things you don't have and that's just not good for you i mean that can be materialistically or it can be like any other way but i just always think of the things that you are blessed with and be extra grateful for them count your blessings twice um, life is just good. So I was about to make an English muffin and then I realized that I had frozen bananas so I was like that's perfect because I didn't want to eat any carbs since I already had a good bit of carbs today and I'm going to tonight. So I just did the frozen bananas blended up with some dark chocolate chips, just a few and then some oats and I'm going to eat this and then I brought my studying stuff that I have not studied since Wednesday for my test tomorrow from the one that got canceled last Monday. And I'm going to finish up watching some YouTube videos and then move on to studying this. Alrighty, so I just got the barbecue cranberry meatballs in the um, crock pot. And they have to cook for like two to three hours. I think I'm going to leave around 5.45 and it's 3.45 now. So that'll be two hours exactly. And then I'll let them cook a little bit more when I get there. Hey guys, so I just got home from Friendsgiving. It was great. It's around 8 o'clock now and it was so much fun. The food was amazing. All of us like brought our own stuff and it all was so, so yummy and I'm like really full now. I have some leftover meatballs so like if I get hungry later I'll just eat some of them because I don't want them to go to waste. But I'm just going to drink a ton of water because I haven't had that much today and it just sounds really good and I'm about to change into some comfy clothes because I've literally been in this outfit since like 9 a.m. That's what's going on now. I think I'm going to just study and work on my marketing projects some more and I'm gonna try and go to bed early because I want to go to bar at 5 30 tomorrow morning since I've eaten so bad all weekend hey guys so I just wanted to go ahead and end off the vlog because it's around 9 30 I think and I'm just studying for my test that I have to go take tomorrow I think that's what I'm gonna be doing for the next two hours probably and tomorrow morning but I'm vlogging tomorrow so Y'all will see me in that vlog. Thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to let me know if y'all liked this weekend of my life thing because I will try and do a lot next semester when I come back. But um, definitely let me know if you liked it and give it a thumbs up if you did and subscribe if you aren't already and I'll see you in my next video.